Hi, everybody. Welcome to Long Island. He's Ray Ferraro. I'm James Sabalski. Ray, an opportunity to take a real stranglehold on this one here tonight. Another win would really put them in a good spot. Driver's seat for sure. Both teams lined up in the middle. We are ready to get things underway. Don't you just love playoff hockey? Listen to this place. Let's get after it. Gets the full use of his stick on the poke check. New York's looking to break out. Scrum ensues along the boards. The Penguins have it against the wall. Slides the puck over to Latang. They gain the offensive zone from the middle. Pulak's lugging the puck. The Islanders move it in, and he loses control of the puck. The Islanders gain possession along the wall. Puck picked up by Kapanen. New York's ready to go on the attack. Keeps hold of the puck. Pittsburgh's looking to break out of their own end. Here's a chance! Stopped by the goaltender. Had to be sharp. That's a great A chance. Passes on over to Nelson. Skates to the crease. Scores! Listen to this place. What a start for them. Get the game's first goal. Now they have to keep the pressure on. That's a scorer's goal right there. That puck is on and off his stick in a hurry. He's so tight to the net. He has to get rid of it before the goalie can readjust. The Islanders get off to a great start here, leading 1-0. Well, they get everybody through the lineup, and now they're on the board already. Great start for them. Puck scooped up by Letty. And he'll take a step back here deep inside his own zone. Battle along the boards. And he loses both the puck and his balance after that hit. Mayfield's taking it from his own end. Pokes it away to keep the pressure on. The Islanders, he's got a little jump. Takes it to the net. It's in the back of the net. He scores! That's just a minute between goals. Wow, insane how quick that was. Bang, bang. Yeah, the defending team just couldn't put a stake in the ground. They couldn't stop them. Well, once he saw that open room, James, he just motored away from everybody. He makes no mistake to score on the breakaway. We're still in the early stages of this period. New York's got a two-goal lead. They'd love to build on it. Puck is dropped, and we are back underway. Moves it quickly over to Jankowski. Takes control of the puck. He was locked in there. Heads to the back of the net. The Islanders have it now. And he regains control of the puck. Pittsburgh's gained possession along the boards. Grabbed along the board by Sevier. Oh, he'd like to have that pass back. Boychuk's got the puck in his own zone. Knocked away. Taken by Sevier. With possession along the wall. Centering pass! And now it's over to Pedersen. And the puck leaves the offensive zone. They'll be forced to tag up. The Penguins will play it in their own end. Takes the feed. Quick feed to Pedersen. Passes the puck over to McCann. Right to the middle. Snaps one here in the slot. And that's blocked. Sends it down low. And it's a quick pass to Pedersen. Good reach to the stick to knock the puck away. Scrum along the boards. Good heads-up play in the defensive zone. The Penguins have it in the offensive end. Great save by Harlamov. Still lots of time left in the period. New York's got a 2-0 lead. The Penguins win it. Puck grab by Matheson. Denies him in front. Hey, score! His first career playoff goal! The 
different level of excitement, James. You score in the regular season, that's one thing. You get another one in the playoffs, and you are pumped. The goalie's barely in position here. That puck is snapped back so quickly, he can't react to the shot. Pittsburgh's got one back. Lots of offensive fireworks so far. Ah, this is great. I love goals, James. You know that. So yeah. it looks like there's lots of goals on the docket tonight. And now it's grabbed by Pellick. Sends a pass over. Great poke check on the reach. Up along the wing. Here's a chance. Settles things down and gets control of it once again. And that shot gets caught in traffic. Sezikis plays it into the offensive zone. Tries to dangle and the puck skips away. There are times you try to do too much. He's got good hands, but maybe a more simple play is the right one there. And he slides it quickly to Malkin. Loses possession after he takes a little hit. Pokes it away here in the neutral zone. The Penguins get a hold of the puck. Looking for space inside the D zone. Through the open ice, they're picking up steam. Tremendous stop by Varlamov. Handles the puck. Here's a short pass to Pellick. Looks to get the puck over to Bailey. And he slides it quickly to Nelson. Big play inside the defensive zone. Puck picked up by Kapanen. Pittsburgh's got it in their own zone. And that one's broken up. Quick pass to Crosby. Picked up along the boards by Beauvillier. Puck knocked loose after that hit. Pittsburgh's got control of it now from their own end. Gains the zone. Here's a shot. Denies. Scores! Well, you just keep working away. Your lines roll over and over and over. You hope to build a little momentum. One shot ties the game. And now it's a whole new ball game. And we are all evened up here. When you get into this position, that puck's got to be off your stick in a hurry. You don't have much time to think about it. More than half the period left to play. We got a tie game. Well, that's one way to win the draw as he skates away with the puck after the two centers were tied up. New York's got it in their own zone. Feeds the puck to Everly. They go on the attack through center. To his teammate! Latang's tripped up and the official's hand is in the air, signaling penalty. And let's see what the definitive call is on the ice. And tripping looks to be the call, Ray. Really a frustrating penalty to take because you're just fishing for the puck. You get your stick in the wrong spot, the guy goes down and you're toast every time. The Penguins get their man advantage unit out there for the first time tonight. I love playing on the power play. I like the extra time. I like the fact that you're supposed to score. If you can't handle the pressure, they're going to replace you. And that one's broken up by a great defensive play. They move the puck out of harm's way. Pittsburgh's got a hold of it along the wall. Slides the puck across to Gensel. Absolutely levels him. Moves it to Mayfield. Came up with the save on that play. Let's get another look at that hit. I love that contact. Clean, right through the body. See it right here. That's a big hit. Play set to resume with the face-off ready to go. Sezikas is quick on the draw. Slides it to Zucker. Denied by the goaltender. Well past the midway mark of this period, the next goal could be a big one as we are tied. Takes possession of the puck off the draw. Gets it out of his own end. Pittsburgh's got the puck along the wall. And he gets in the lane to block that. From their own end, trying to kickstart this power play. Now a quick pass to Gensel. Great positioning by the defender. Here's a chance, a two-on-one. The Penguins take it from their own end with time running out on this man advantage. 
Looking to make something happen along the boards. Went for the dirty dangle and it goes sideways. The man advantage is over. Really good pressure by the penalty killers there to keep this game tied. They tie up the power play in pretty nice fashion there. New York's got a hold of the puck. Angles it over to Eberle. Can't maintain possession after that hit. Tries to get it to Del Cole. Let's it go. He scores! His first career playoff goal! He was saying to a couple guys this morning he thought he was going to be able to score soon. Looks like he's right. He swept this one up over the goalie's glove. The room wasn't there until the goalie dropped into the butterfly, maybe a little early, opened up some space up top. New York's been preaching better starts. They've got that with a one-goal lead, Ray. They've got the lead. It's in the first period. There's lots of game left, but their coaches are talking about staying on the front foot to be aggressive. Here's a shot denied by the puck stopper. 27, Anders Lee. And by number 55, Johnny Boychuk. The Penguins are still trailing here in this first period despite the opportunities they've had. Pittsburgh's won the faceoff. Centering pass. And that one's broken up. Great block there. Knocks the puck away in the open ice. Tennis got it along the wing. The Islanders get a hold of the puck along the boards. And a nice poke check inside the neutral zone. Off the left wing and into center. And now he moves it to Del Cole. That's just a great heads up read at center ice. Jankowski's caught up with the hook and the official saw it. Time for the official to pass down his sentence. The Islanders have been called for hooking. Even though he's gonna argue this, I mean, there's nothing to argue about. His stick gets across the player's midsection. It's a penalty. The power play unit goes right back to work. This is a pretty simplistic power play. They like to get the puck, shoot it, crash the net, get it back, and shoot it again. What a great time to have a man advantage as they trail by one. Denies him on the slaughter. Wow. He scores! Now, this is a different level here. You get into your first playoffs, and you're able to get on the board. Good thing he one times his puck. The goalie almost gets there, but the pass is on his tape in the low slot, and he beats him clean. Here in the back half of this period, you can feel the energy in this crowd. It's a tie game. Pittsburgh's won it. Puck scooped up by Dumoulin. Slides it over to Latang. Picked up along the wall by Lee. Carries the puck through the neutral zone. The Penguins take possession in the defensive end. Maintains possession. Trying to get back on the attack now. Battling for it along the boards. Looks like we got a penalty coming up here. Into the attacking end. And he sprints to the bench to get the extra attacker out on the ice. And play is finally halted here. Let's see what the call is. Lee's been called for holding. Oh, he got his money's worth there. That is a holding penalty. The Penguins once again send out their power play unit. When we talked to both coaches, they talked about how important the power play was. What I like about this team, though, they've already scored, and they look like they're hungry for more. And there's the save. And now he angles it across to Malkin. Blocked in front. Trying to come up with a huge defensive play to get this puck out of his own end. Looking to break out here on the power play. Pittsburgh's moving it along the wing. The Penguins played along the wing. Takes a blast. Denied by Varlamov. The centermen glide into position. Sneaks away with the puck after he was tangled up on the draw. 
The Islanders will try to shave a few seconds off this penalty now. Puck is cleared out of the defensive zone. The Penguins scoop it up along the boards. Dishes it to McCann. Picked off in the open ice. Moves it quickly over to Mayfield. Bailey's going to play it against the half wall. And he makes the save. And now he moves it quickly to Zucker. Pittsburgh's got the puck against the boards. He was right there and they can't convert. The Islanders get the job done shorthanded. We are still tied here. His reflexes on display tonight. You're always angry when you don't score on the power play. But 80% of the time you don't. Yet it becomes really frustrating when you let one slip away. In the final moments of this period, we are all tied up in this one. Tees him up, and he comes up with a huge stop. New York's got it in the offensive zone. Pass back to the point. Slides it up front. With the one-timer. Taken by Pedersen. From his own end, he moves it up ahead. Here they are on the attack. Oh, denies him with the save. I think he got the blocker on it. Barlamov's always so secure in his save selection. Nice stop, but the rebound in the corner is the best part. Hangs onto the puck. Takes that one right in the logo. And there's the whistle giving him a chance to exhale. Officials getting ready to drop the puck. Puck possession so key in today's game. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. The Islanders take over on possession. Quick feed to Everly. Here's a shot. Stopped by the goaltender. The Islanders win the faceoff. Let's it go. And that one's blocked. Takes a bump but still hangs on to the puck. Everly's looking around near the point. Scooped up along the wall by Matheson. Pittsburgh's got the puck in the defensive end. New York's got a hold of it against the wall. Slides it quickly to Everly. Can't hang on to the puck after the play. Pokes it away in his own end. A spirited battle along the boards for the puck. And it's a quick pass to Ruido. The Penguins play it along the boards. Good defensive stop with the poke check. Tries to get the puck to Everly. Slides it diagonally to Gensel. The Penguins take it across the line. Takes the shot. Denies him on the one-timer. Here in the late goings of the period, it's all tied up. Gets a hold of the puck. Slides it across to Boychuk. Grabs control of it at the point. Takes the pass. Tried to get 2Q with it and loses possession. Wanted to get in just a little closer. Puck slides off his stick and that's it for the chance. Excellent stick work on the play. And that's picked off. There's the horn for period number one. Holy moly, what a shootout here in the first period. Hey, fans, a portion of tonight's proceeds will fund a children's play at City Hospital, providing a safe, fun environment for kids visiting long-term care patients. If you'd like to learn more or to donate, please visit our team website. Both teams heading down the tunnels. We'll take a quick breath ourselves and be back for the second period. Sabalski, Ray Ferraro bringing you all the action. Period number two is about to go. All tied up here as the second period gets set to get underway here. It's been a fun one. Lots of offense. 
offense so far. One period already in the books. Ray, how have you seen this thing? The Islanders are pretty fortunate that this game is still tied. They really haven't generated much of anything offensively yet. Long reach breaks up the momentum. Feeds it over to Gensel. Here's a short pass to Crosby. Offside the call, and we'll have a face-off just outside the blue line. Lots of time left in this period. We got a tie game. The Islanders win the faceoff and tries to make a diagonal pass to Lee. And a great heads up defensive play here. Pittsburgh got into the offensive zone. There's the whistle. Offside is the call, stopping the play. The setters will glide into the dot. Barzell's won it. Puck grabbed by Pulak. And now it's grabbed by Pellick. Play whistle dead because of an offside. Nelson's won the draw here in the neutral zone. The Penguins ready to go on the attack. Quick feed to Rust. Pinned up along the boards. Strong defensive effort. Quick pass to Rust. The blocker saved by Varlamov. Almost lost the puck, but hangs on here as play continues. Directs it on over to Letty. Here's a chance right in the slot. Turns it away. Flashes the leather right in the slot on a difficult chance. As a great older colleague of mine says, this is waffle boarded away. The Islanders win the draw. And now he tries to get it across to Bailey. Stopped by the goaltender. Still early on in this frame, James and Ray with you. So glad you could join us. The next goal could be a big one as we are tied. Offense his own face off and he wins the draw. Oh, what an effort giving up the body there. The Penguins gain control of the puck against the wall. Sends the pass over. Scoops up the puck here. Strong defensive effort. Jankowski swooping in on the attack. Here's a shot with the stop. He reacts late, but he makes a save through traffic. Along the half wall with the puck. Shot! Long jam in front. That's broken up. Nice zone entry from the left. Takes the puck at the point. Moves it to Jankowski. Stopped by the goaltender. Boychuk's moving the puck through his own zone. Taken along the wall by Tanev. Here they come, three of them. Glove save, somehow got a piece of it. Sizikis works the puck in his own zone. Went for the dirty dangle and it goes sideways. Tanev's caught with the hook and the officials saw it. Here comes the official's decision. Hooking's the call. This is what yep. they kind of call the lazy penalty these days, yeah, right? It is, but it, but really the problem is you're beat and you panic and you're trying to help. And the more you help, the worse it gets. Go sit down. And he certainly dug himself a hole there. Pittsburgh's got another opportunity here on the man advantage. Well, this has been a bag of chocolates, hasn't it, James? You don't know what you're getting from this power play. It's just been average. From point blank, spectacular stop. Puts it in for the go-ahead goal. Control the game now. You finally got the lead. You worked so hard to get in front. Don't give it up now. I think he goes down a little quick here, James. Drops into the butterfly. Thinks he's got it covered, but gets beat top bins on the stick side. The 
the Penguins go ahead by one. They had to work for that one. A lot of work put in just to get yourself inching into the lead. There's still lots of time left. New York's won the draw. The Islanders have it against the wall. The Penguins have a hold of it in the defensive zone. Slides the puck over. From the right wing, he moves it to the middle. Comes up with the stop. New York's gained possession along the boards and pokes the puck loose inside the offensive end. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. Moves it quickly over to Mayfield. Shot and a great save. Pittsburgh's moving it up the ice. Puts it up front, lets it fly. And that's blocked. Takes a shot, nothing doing. Lifts the stick and takes the puck. Here's a chance right in front. Stopped by the goaltender. Sharp reaction save. I want to go back to that chance we had just a moment ago. The goalie reads the play well, makes a great save on a really good scoring chance. We haven't even hit the midway mark of the period. The Penguins are hanging on to this one goal lead. They'd love to add another. Back to the point it goes. Shot, and he comes up with it. The Penguins have been the better team, leading in the shot department, and they lead it on the scoreboard. Pittsburgh's won the draw, and they'll go to work. Quick feed to Rust. Denied by the goaltender. Great on-ice vision to bat that down. And that one stopped. Feeds the puck across to Beauvillier. Here's a short pass to Bailey. And he uses his reach to disrupt the play. And he slides it quickly to Pedersen. Gains the zone through the middle. Solid hit on the play, and that knocks the puck off his stick. Quick pass across to Beauvillier. Pass to Tanev. The Penguins play it along the boards. Takes the feed. Oh, that's a smart heads-up play as he breaks it up with the poke. Moves the puck. Oh, smart heads-up play to poke that one away. Nice pass. Cuts to the paint. Too much congestion in front. Scrum along the boards as they battle for the puck. And he slides it quickly to Matheson. With the steal. Takes the pass as he banks it off the wall. We got a delayed call coming up here as the referee raises his hand. Gets to the bench for the extra attacker. Centering pass. And they capitalize for the goal. You know, James, that kills the power play, but I'd still like to see the rules amended so they would still get the power play. They earned one. Now they don't even get it. Goalie just can't keep up with this. He's close to the net, but he's still able to have enough room to beat the goaltender. Penguins have now jumped out to a two-goal lead here in the second, and it's pretty much a result of the way they played here tonight, Ray. They, it is, James. They've done a nice job. They've controlled the play. They've had the pace of the game in their favor, had the majority of shots on goal, and they've been rewarded. From the left side, takes it at center. On the doorstep, quick shot. Stones him in front. Inching closer to the midway mark of the period. Pittsburgh's got a two-goal lead. They'd love to build on it. Steps in and takes the puck. Quick pass to Pellet. Here's an offensive chance. Wide! New York's got the puck along the boards. Gives them nothing in front. Here's a stretch pass to McCann. And the puck leaves the zone. Passes it over to McCann. The Penguins carry it along the wall. And that one's turned away. Receives the pass. Grabbed along the boards by Jubilin. Feeds the puck to McCann. From the left side, they enter the attacking zone. The Islanders have it from their own end. Pucks it away to stay on the attack. Takes the feed. Easily turned away by the glove.
He had to be on top of his game to make that stop. That's a great scoring chance, and he turns it aside. The Penguins continue to lead in the second. They have been the busier team in the shot department, and as a result, they lead. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Penalty coming up here as the play is stopped. And it's going to be two minutes for hooking on the call. A lot of people debate, is this a lazy penalty, the hook? I don't know if it's lazy all the time, but it's a penalty of being out of position. Your stick's parallel to the ice. You get called all the time. Pittsburgh's power play unit puts their hard hats on as they go back to work. Right from the way they break out of the zone and enter in, this power play looks like it's all on the same page tonight. Here's another chance. Scores! With a little added drink on the side. I like when the bottle goes up in the air how angry the goalie gets, like he slaps the bottle away. It's not the bottle's fault. Like, stop the puck, man. Just the insult to injury with the bottle pop. Not often the power play works right off a face-off. Lots of times you want to get it set up, but this is too good a shot to pass up. Pittsburgh's been lighting the lamp all night long thus far, and it continues here in the second. Domination. Goals almost at every turn. Hey, buddy, you need to put your controller down. This is not fair. Rocked on the play. Tosses it to Lee. Moves it to Marcel. Centered out in front. And that one's broken up by a great defensive play. That knocks him off the puck. Tosses it up in the neutral zone. The Penguins take it along the wall. Huge play in his own end to come up with the puck. The Islanders take it across the blue line. Off the outside of the iron and will play on. New York's effort really has been fine throughout this game, but they're down a bunch. They'd like one bounce to go their way, but not there. Now a quick pass to Zucker. From the left side, they enter the offensive zone. From the right side and up the middle. Moves the puck across to Pedersen. Pass across to Rust. Jabs the puck away. A chance! Stopped by the goaltender. Oh, he had to get up tight to the puck. In close, he takes away any room. Everly's disappointment is obvious. This is a good shot, a really good release, and you get nothing for it when it hits the pipe. Pittsburgh's offense came to play in a big way, and they lead big time here in the second. The Islanders get a hold of the puck in their own end. Takes the feed from the wing. Streaking through center, they go on the attack. Moves it quickly over to Nelson. Huge steal in his own end. Sends a pass over. The official signaling for a penalty as play is called. The Islanders have been handed a two-minute penalty for tripping. Reaching out for the puck. I guess it's a little bit of a bad play. You've got to realize the guy's getting away. Let him go before you take the penalty. The official's making him pay for it. The Penguins send their man advantage unit out once more. Every once in a while, you get a full moon and a great power play. They're having it tonight. Everything is going their way. And that's picked off in front. And now he moves it quickly to Letty. A little dipsy doodle, and he loses possession of the puck. There are times you try to do too much. He's got good hands, but maybe a more simple play is the right one there. Steps inside. Quick feed to Letty. Centered out in front. Scores! Not the special teams unit we expected to deliver. No, this is a real turning point in the game here as the shorthanded group capitalizes, gets on the board. It's hard enough to be the goalie when you have to stop the shot. This thing's like a rubber ball. It's bouncing all over the place and somehow ends up behind the goalie. That's a tough break for him. The Islanders have shown some life here in the second. It's about time, James. They're down two. They've got a long way to go to claw back into this. Quick pass to Gensel. Player goes down to the ice. There's the referee's hand in the air. Looks like we got a tripping penalty on the way. 
Pulak's off to the box. Two minutes for tripping. Always a little careless to get a tripping penalty. You get your stick into the player's feet, and when he goes down, you're going to go to the box. Penalty killing units set to earn their keep tonight as they'll try to kill off a five-on-three man advantage. Five-on-three can really change the game. Tip it on its head by getting a couple goals on a rather lengthy power play. And the puck leaves the zone. Here's a short pass to Malkin. Snapper from the slot. Stops him with a glove. Great tracking. He finds the puck. He gets the glove up. Makes the save on a dangerous chance. The Penguins have been the more active squad, and they continue to lead late in the second period. Puck is dropped, and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. Good clearing attempt to breathe. Pittsburgh's got a hold of it along the wall. Slides it over with pace to Zucker. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. Snaps one on net. Oh, what a save with the stick by Parlamov. Puck moved back to the neutral zone. The Penguins gain possession along the wall. Nice poke check inside the attacking zone. Knocks the puck loose. Off his stick. Stops him cold. Well, you're not going to get much better scoring chance than that one, but the goaltender makes an excellent stick save. Play set to resume with the faceoff ready to go. Nice start winning the draw here inside the offensive zone. Denies that opportunity. No room for the shooter. The goaltender snuffed it out. Getzel's gaining momentum. It's a two-on-one. Pittsburgh's power play is over. What a disaster as they give up a shorthanded goal. Well, they're not going to think too much about that. You, will, you want to at least generate a little momentum on your power play. Not only did they not score, they gave up a shorty, which is always deflating. That's a smart read with the two centermen tied up. New York's playing it through the neutral zone. Moves it to Beauvillier, and he easily stops that one. The Islanders will go to work here in the offensive zone. Big save. This is a quality chance that the goaltender turns aside right from the slot. The Penguins continue to lead here in the late stages of this second period. Setters jammed up and the winger grabs the puck. Dumps it into the O-zone. The Islanders get a hold of the puck along the boards. Takes the pass. Pittsburgh's looking to break out of their own end. And now it's over to Matheson. Through center. Moves it to Tanev. Move to the middle. That's a textbook save by Barlama. The centermen glide into position. New York's got it in the defensive zone. Tries to get it over to Del Cole. Good hit to pump him off the puck. Moves it around along the half wall. Pokes it away to keep the pressure on. Battling for it along the boards. The Islanders will play it from the defensive zone. Oh, we got a penalty coming up as you can see that he was slowed down on the play. And there's the whistle stopping the play. The Penguins have been handed two minutes for hooking. I hated taking these penalties. It meant that I was out of position a little bit. And you have to do something in desperation. The Islanders will have a chance to get on the power play for the first time this evening. New York's won the draw. Wrist one. Turned aside with a glove. Quick hands. Not only does he get a glove on it, he catches it, which is hard to do.
Second period nearly in the books here. Great defensive stick work on the play. Trying to get it out. And it's a small victory for the PK unit here. Well, that's their job. Get it down the ice, get off the ice, get some new people out there. Takes it and looks ahead. Moves it quickly over to Nelson. Takes a bump but hangs on to the puck. Made that stop. Yeah, he flashes the leather there to make the stop on a really difficult chance. Pittsburgh's up for good reason. They have been the more complete team offensively, which is why they lead late in the second. They take possession as he locks them up off the faceoff. Along the boards, they battle for the puck. Officials getting ready to drop the puck. Puck possession so key in today's game. Well, not exactly a banner night for the goaltenders as the second period comes to an end. At least they'll get a breather here. Present your ticket stuff from tonight's game and receive up to 10% off of your meal at Bunsville Burgers Family Restaurants. Don't go anywhere. Third period is coming up, and it's coming up next. James Sabolski, Ray Ferraro ready to bring you all the action. Period number three is set to get underway. The Islanders start the period off on the right note, winning the draw, and their man advantage unit gets going. The Penguins gain possession of the defensive zone, and the puck is cleared to a safer spot. The Islanders have it behind the net. Pumps the puck away. Loses his balance on the play. Kind of lost control for a second there, but regains possession. The Penguins have put a lot of pucks on net, and as a result, they lead it early in this third period. And a good read to get possession there with the two centermen tangled up. And the puck is moved to a safer spot on the ice. The Islanders fire blanks on the power play. We're back to even strength here. And the parade to the penalty box will continue as play is called for yet another penalty. The Penguins will serve two minutes in the box. A uh, step, a step and a half out of position, and you get called reaching out to try to slow your opponent down. Back to the face-off circle. They'll send the man advantage unit out again. If you can find a way to get a power play goal here, you can change the momentum of this game. They haven't got one yet tonight. And you find yourself starting to press when you don't score. The Islanders scoop it up along the boards. Feeds it on over to Nelson. Tries to get it out of the zone. Call that a win for the penalty killers on that one. Yeah, he slams it off the glass. Now the power play's got to go back to get set up. The Penguins take possession in the neutral zone. Across the line. From the slot. Denies him. Barlamov so sharp on this. Reads the play, reads the puck, makes the save. Makes the save. Takes the puck as the clock ticks down on the penalty kill. They clear the zone. New York's got a hold of it against the wall. Quick feed to Nelson. Moves the puck along the half wall. Trying to clear. Cross the blue line and they'll get that much needed change, Ray. Yeah, they've got to get guys off the ice. They look tired. Now you can get a fresh group on the ice. Quick pass to Beauvillier. And it's a quick pass to Nelson. And makes the save. Picked up along the boards by Lee. Slides the puck down low. Can't keep a hold of it after that hit. Couldn't connect on that pass. Puck picked up by Dumoulin. And now he moves it to Sevier. Move to the middle! Great defensive effort with the strip. Puck scooped up by Mayfield. Good defensive effort to poke it away. Play rolls on. And that skips away on a nice defensive deflection. Denies him on the one-timer. Oh, what reaction. The Islanders looking against the half wall. Move to the middle. And he's able to handle that one. A 
That's a pretty good scoring chance. That's a chance the shooter thinks might go in, but the goalie turns it aside. Pittsburgh's done a wonderful job putting a lot of pucks on net, and they lead it early in this third period. Off the draw, and a nice job locking up his opponent. The Penguins move the puck in the defensive zone. Picked up along the wall by Ruedel. Pittsburgh's got it against the boards. Passes it to Kapanen. Pittsburgh's got it along the wall. Taken by Crosby. Stopped by the goaltender. Barlamov's got the puck. Boy, he's been under fire tonight. Been really sharp, and in a close game, you can't make a mistake that costs a critical goal. Pittsburgh's got the edge in the shot department, a big reason why they lead here in this third period. The Penguins win it. Here's a short pass to Zucker. That's blocked. They gain the offensive zone from the middle. Moves it to Pellick. Back at the point, they set it up. And the goalie covers up for the whistle. The setters will glide into the dot. And as the puck is dropped, they win the draw here inside the defensive zone. And that one's picked off. Here's a shot and makes the save. Nice job tying up his opponent. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Move to the middle, and that's broken up. Rust's got it in the offensive end. And a poke check knocks the puck away. Dumps it in. The Penguins have it against the wall. Working the puck deep inside their own end. And that pass is intercepted. Getting a little too physical to maintain possession. New York's gained possession along the boards. The Islanders pick up the puck here in the neutral zone. Deflected away. Nice defensive use of the stick there. Comes up with the stop. Barlamov's going to cover it up. He's been busy tonight, Ray. And been good. A lot of times you get busy and worn down. I think that's why you jump on it, freeze it in a close game. Barzell's won it off the faceoff. From the right side, they gain the zone. Stays with it. And he's taken down the official's arm, signaling for a penalty. Let's see the call here. The Islanders are going to be shorthanded because of a tripping call. Trying to get into position to get to the puck. He takes out the player's feet, and off to the box he'll go. The Penguins once again send out their power play unit. They've zipped the puck around pretty nicely on their previous power plays, and they've been rewarded for their fine work. The key is to stay sharp. Don't think it's just going to happen for you. Enters the offensive zone from the left. Handles the puck. Along the right side into the offensive zone. Takes a shot. Oh, what a stop with the blocker by Varlamov. Trying to get back on the attack now. Sends the pass over. Sezikis is part of a new wave of penalty killers that thinks offense while he's killing the penalty. He's got one shorthanded goal already. New York's got possession while undermanned. Wax it into the offensive zone. Pittsburgh's got the puck along the boards. Along the side, here they come through the neutral zone. Tries to the crease. And he denied that opportunity. Big save by the goaltender once again. Bailey's taking it from his own end. The Penguins come up empty-handed on the power play. Both sides back to even strength. Well, there hasn't been enough of this lately, James, where they kill off the power play with no damage. They've been underwater for a little while. Barlamov's going to hang on for a whistle here in the third. Well, there's not much time left here as you get into the final 20 minutes. The game's closed. A mistake now would be critical. These are positional saves. This is a good scoring chance, and he makes the stop with his stick. The Penguins have been the aggressor offensively tonight as they continue to lead in the third. Pittsburgh's got it in the offensive zone. And a stick in the lane ends that threat. The Islanders have it now. 
The Penguins gain control of the puck against the wall. Moves it quickly over to Lee. Nice stick work to knock the puck loose. Sends it in deep. The Penguins have the puck now. Exploring options here inside the defensive zone. And now he angles it across to Kapanen. And that's broken up with a stick in front. With the stop. Boychuk's lugging the puck. Dished on over to Everly. Moved in front. And that one's broken up. Great flop there. Nice poke check. New York's got the puck along the wall. Pittsburgh's gained possession. Scooped up along the wall by Ruedel. He carries the puck up along the wing. Quick feed to Tanev. Takes a hit. He goes down to the ice and coughs up the puck. Scrum along the boards. And pokes the puck loose inside the offensive end. New York's got it along the wall. Drives to the sweet spot. I think it's a chance for a breather here as he hangs on and covers the puck up. Who, for the players or for you? Well, you know, I won't complain. Puck possession so critical. Another face-off coming up here. Pittsburgh's won the face-off deep in their own end. Slides the puck over. Looks to pass it to Ruido. Takes the feed. New York's got a hold of it along the wall. Puck dumped in. Pittsburgh's got it behind the net. Works it across to Jankowski. Tosses it on to Sevier. Steps into the offensive end. And he takes a shot. Oh, what a big time stop by Harlamov. Pittsburgh's been the better team tonight. They have turned good defense into solid offense, and they lead here in the third. Jankowski's won the draw. Quick pass to Sevier. Takes that pass back at the point with the steal. New York's across the blue line. And he regains control of the puck. Completely misses on the play. You don't even make the goalie work here. You've got to make him have to do something in the net. Moves the puck to Pellet. Can't connect. Takes control of the puck. The Penguins gain possession along the wall. Gensel's eyes are looking for three. He's got... Oh, look at that. Here we go. We got a penalty coming up right here. We got a penalty coming up on the play. Sevier's getting called for tripping on the play. I always found this a frustrating penalty to take. There's really no aggression to it. You're trying to steal the puck, but you end up clipping the guy down. Another chance here on the man advantage. Easiest thing in the world, James. Tell somebody else to relax. The power play hasn't scored yet. They're not relaxed, and it's not easy to do, but that's the key to success. Made the stop on that play. Denies him again. He's right on it. Two consecutive saves. Tough ones at that. We'll take another look at that stop he made just a couple of minutes ago. Really good work here with his team in the lead to stay on the shot and make the save. Play set to resume with the face-off ready to go. Off the draw, and he ties up his opponent. Trying to get the puck out of his own end. And he gets the job done. Big thumbs up, clearing that one. Beauvillier's moving it ahead. Knocked away. Pittsburgh's got the puck against the half wall. The Islanders look to start the transition game. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Beauvillier. Moves the puck. Slides it across. Right in the slot. And they can't connect. And the play continues. And they get the puck out of harm's way. Gets it over to Beauvillier. Nice zone entry on the left side. Manages to hang on. Pinned up along the boards. Puck grabbed by Beauvillier. And that shot dies in traffic. The Islanders get a hold. And it's a one-goal game as he buries it. You want to make this thing believable for yourself. You've got to get away from that two-goal deficit. They've done it here. And now they'll look for the tying goal. The goalie's not going to catch this. The pass from behind the net's on the tape. One-timed into the cage before he can really get turned around.
New York's come back with a big one here in the third. Grind away, dig away. You got a chance, only trailing by one goal. This neutral zone face-off set to go, and we are back underway. Strong use of the body to force the puck loose. Barzell's working it around in the corner. Moves right to the middle. And now it's grabbed by Gensel. Here's a short pass to Crosby. The Penguins move it ahead. And now he tries to get it across to Gensel. Nice pass. Couldn't make that one happen. Moves it to Crosby. And he's ridden off the puck. The Islanders take possession in the defensive end. The Penguins scoop it up along the boards. Denies it in front. Smothered that in close chance. Takes a shot. Great reflexes. Another save. Really sharp. Never loses sight of the puck to make the second save. I wanted another look at this one. I'm sure you guys were all impressed as I was. What a save by the goalie. Pittsburgh's been the better team offensively tonight. A lot of scoring chances, and they lead it late in this third period. And with the two centers tangled up, the winger skates away with it. Receives the pass. New York's got a hold of it against the wall. Takes the feed. Great defensive effort with the stick. Puck picked up by Pichon. The Penguins have it against the wall. Here he is in front. Turns it away. Barlamov's going to hang on and just let things settle down for a moment. He really didn't have many options to play the puck, but no. in a close game, you want to be sure every time you do. The centermen glide into position. Nearing the final minute of the third. In the third period. Moves it quickly over to Beauvillier. Takes the pass. The Penguins gain possession in their own end. Sends a pass over. Down the right side and into the zone. The Penguins have the puck in the corner. New York's gained possession along the boards. Pittsburgh's got control of it now from their own end. And he slides it quickly to McCann. Through the open ice, they're picking up steam. Pittsburgh's got the puck along the wall. With possession along the wall. Quick feed to Latang. Great defensive play to come up with the puck. He's got to read the scene much better than that. You're already ahead in the game. Don't turn it over and give up scoring chances. New York's emptied the net. The extra attacker's now out on the ice. Offside is the call, and we'll have a face-off just outside the offensive zone. The Penguins win the faceoff. Towards the empty net, misses the net. And we are all over with this one tonight. Well, anybody who thought that this was going to be a quick series has been sorely mistaken after tonight. At the very least, you drop that first game. All you can think about is not the big picture, it's the small one. We need to split the first two games. They did a really good job. Yeah, mission accomplished tonight. For Ray Ferraro, I'm James Sabalski. We'll see you next time we drop the puck.